Hey awesome people, Simpsons Topper here, also known as Topper, from our Discord server TS The Home and our website. I hope everyone's having a wonderful day, evening or night, depending on where you live. So today some exciting news, we get a content update from EA. So it's going to start tomorrow, March 20th, and it's going to go all the way to April 3rd. And the event is called the Great Burnsby. So it is a mini event, it's not a major event. I call it a minor event basically and uh, as I mentioned it's two weeks, starts tomorrow, goes on all the way to April 3rd. Not too much items but nonetheless it's new content with new quests and dialogue. So just make sure if you do have the mod uninstall everything because it is a new version and install everything new from the website. Links are down below along with the instructions. So let's get right into the new content by clicking on toolbox. So right off the bat, we've created the Fears of Clown. So that is the major event that just passed. So if you're missing any of those items from the last event, go right ahead. There's a couple items from Valentine's Day. Let's see here, we got the Heart Cloud, um, Cupid Headquarters along with Cupid Bart. So if you're missing any of the items from the last event, click on each one separately or add it uh, all together. With the new items, just click on the new items menu and you're going to see the night items that are available today and they're actually going to be available for everybody else tomorrow. With every uh, content update there's new currency, so this one is stolen artwork. So I've created a button here where you could add 100 each time and something new I've created the remove all currency for stolen artwork so it will put it back to zero. So as I mentioned, there's nine new items. Three of them are buildings, all of them are unique. First one's personal liability attorney, second one Springfield Funeral Home, and lastly Giuseppe's. Next we have three characters, Roberto De Niro, Maxwell Flinch, Mob Lawyer. We don't have any skins or facades in this update. So lastly we have three decorations. Two of them are non-unique, or actually I should say that two of them are unique and the last one here is a uh, crowd of lawyers which is non-unique so meaning you can put as many as you want in your town so Burns helicopter is unique and so is Moe's convertible so that's it for the content not too much but uh, hopefully you get some interesting quests and some jobs and tasks that are associated with it so here are the nine items Feel free to add them all at once just by clicking this button here and you'll get this dialog. And then if you go into your inventory, you'll see all the items here that are added. If at any point you want to empty your inventory because you do have a lot of items, click on the cleaning bottle here. And this one here will fix broken items or will remove all the items from your inventory or currencies. So take a look go into this menu but if you do want to remove items click on remove old items menu and then click on remove all items from inventory and I'll ask you twice and if you click on yes then your inventory will be emptied out so just make sure that whatever you want in your account place it in your town before you do uh, an inventory cleaning also I did want to mention Anything that gets updated in the store menu also gets updated in your in inventory. So as you can see, Fears of Clown is there, um, and then all the previous events as well. So lots of goodies. Take a look. Here's the store menu, so same thing. All previous events, there's more than 4,200 items since the game started roughly 12 years ago. So take a look at each one. Each one has an add-all for each sub menu. If you go further down, um, there's stuff items that you can look at. There's popular items that we constantly get asked. Take a look at that one there. Add debris. If you deleted all your debris by accident, you can add it back. Also, if you're a designer, feel free to use this menu. It's got the most popular items for designing a town. And next we have transportation, 
So all the items from transportation. Next we have nature. These have just recently been all updated. We'll take a look. And lastly, infrastructure. Lots of fences, walls, gates, you name it. It's all there. I won't go in uh, one by one because that'll be a long video. I'm trying to keep the video under uh, five minutes. And then lastly, you have alphabetical order um, unique items. So if you're looking for a unique item, I've already added the the five. They're out of this event. So they're in the beginning of A. Next update, I'll, I'll put them in alphabetical order. But with new items, I like to put it just in the uh, A uh, folder. But as I mentioned, this is to find unique items in your town. So if you have the item in your town, it'll find that item. If you don't have it, you might have it in your inventory, it'll find it in your inventory. And if lastly you don't have it, then it will be uh, sought out in the menus and then you can add it. So there it is, I don't have that one in my town. And then you can add it, which I won't, but uh, just to give everyone an example. In our previous um, video, we talked about all the top menu buttons being updated as well. I won't go into detail with them, but take a look. This one here is for designers. This one's for scratching tickets. This one's for popular items. Gill is for adding. Deed is for unlocking your land and upgrading buildings. This one here is for cleaning, so it's removing items or fixing items. Searching items is this one here, and then lastly is uh, syncing your town or your account, which is on the far right here. So I hope you enjoy the new content with the great Burnsby uh, event that's going to start tomorrow. And once again, it's going to last two weeks and it's going to go all the way to April 3rd. Um, if you are interested in our mod, check out the description down below. And as always, you know, give it a thumbs up if you like this video, subscribe to our channel, leave any comments or feel free to join our Discord server and chat about the game or the mod if you have any suggestions or any improvements. That's it for me. Catch you on the flip side.